cultures have not drastically changed they have become more deeper i would say deeper in humanity deeper in terms of how i understand each other how i want to connect because that's the ask i just hope that it becomes uh, into a very fluidic state so that people start seeing different ways rather than very regimented ways of thinking because then the stories at uh, at a millennial level to that of a people who are well set in the leadership they start accepting different ways of working and that will be quite interesting to see so i want to kind of link up your storytelling the pandemic and you know everything that has taught us also something that you work very uh, deeply right in the realm of culture mm. so how uh, culture would have uh, defined the way leaders would have responded to this crisis so i'm linking all the three and i i leave it to you to play with all the three that's a very interesting space uh, subhash to talk about honestly um culture is is uh, one we say culture is very structured because it governs the way organizations run uh the pandemic actually showed us ways in which that we can work different ways that we can work uh which was early regimented that okay. started crumbling down uh people have started becoming more and more acceptable to things that okay this this could be also a paradigm to look out for uh and paradigm shift shifted so newer ways of working newer businesses started coming up uh more of uh, boutique businesses also started coming and when people said people have lost jobs at the same time different ways uh, of working started coming and people started differently because job losses also also happened now they have impacted the culture in terms of mindsets Mm-hmm. uh challenging themselves making themselves more acceptable to the fact uh i'm talking about the current way in which they're working i'm still a little i'm a little skeptical how it will be when things get back to we won't be i won't call it back to the way we were but yes to a different normalcy that we will get on to uh because when we get into normalcy we we tend to go back to our own old self very quickly unless we're conscious about the fact that we should think uh cultures have not drastically changed they have become more deeper i would say deeper in humanity deeper in terms of how i understand each other how i want to connect because that's the ask when today um uh an employee says that i want to work i want to want to come to office and work from home where home is not the urban places but somewhere in the rural sector Right. uh managers are more or less saying it's fine so that earlier that was not the case you have to be in office you have to clock those hours you have to do those yeah. things today it is it is shifting and it is it is being accepted i know of people of course where the employment market has gone berserk with the kind of offers that are getting rolled out uh, which is a today nightmare not just for business but for the hr guys also uh phenomenal nightmare for the recruiters today um an employee uh, or a prospective candidate holding five different uh, offers in hand and trying to negotiate <laughs> it's is crazy it's really crazy uh while that's happening one of the asks is that can i work from home becoming predominant uh, so okay. the people are asking for it because people have seen that i can work for a company which is in bangalore staying in delhi or in uh, in assam or anywhere else as long as my connectivity now puts are there um people are finding it more comfortable doing that that's one second i'm slowly seeing this wave that earlier we used to say i have one job that i'll do with one organization with the pandemic the other aspect opening is my hobbies my interests how is that expanding and how is that growing so that is also slowly coming in as a culture of acceptance would i accept it will the organization accept it earlier it was that i pay you so you're with me double dual employment can't happen while people are finding avenues to do dual employment more openly in a different way how does the organization actually accept that how will the leadership accept that? as long as my deliverables are met as long as people are thinking contributing to can i continue doing that and these are stories which are slowly evolving and it will evolve more and more india's today india's uh, employment sector is is becoming even more 
uh, fuzzier um, mm. and uh, i just hope that it becomes uh, into a very fluidic state so that people start seeing different ways rather than very regimented ways of thinking because then the stories at uh, at a millennial level to that of a people who are well set in the leadership they start accepting different ways of working and that will be quite interesting to see